Hello, we're going to do an activity now to follow on from our story we just read called In My Heart. So what you need is you need a piece of paper. It can be a big piece of paper. It can be a small piece of paper. It doesn't matter what shape. Okay, so I'll use my big piece of paper so you can see a bit better. What I'd like you to do is you need to fold it in half and then you need to crease one of the edges. See like this. There we go. Okay, now I'm going to draw a special shape on here and I'm going to hold it up when I'm finished so you can see what you need to do next. So next, on the edge where there is a fold, this bit here, can you see? I'd like you to draw this shape here. I wonder whether you can draw this shape and then you might see what it's going to turn into in a minute. So once you've drawn this shape, you need to get a pair of scissors. You might need to ask an adult to have some help with this, or they might want to watch you whilst you're cutting. See what um, the, your person at home says. And then you need to cut all along the line, all the way down the line. There we go. Until you have shape a bit like this and if you fold out your shape oh look we've made a heart like in our story so what I thought you could do today is on the outside you could maybe color in um I'll see what I'm going to add to mine I'm going to add some more hearts to mine and then on the inside you could write here we go they're my hearts then on the inside you could write a message to somebody you love and I thought that would be a nice thing to do today, following our story, following on from our story about our feelings and about our heart as well. And I look forward to showing you this book when we're back at school because it's got a great, great pictures in this book. So it'd be nice to read it together again when you're back. Enjoy making your hearts today and I look forward to seeing you when we're back in school. Bye.